Hey guys, welcome to the Time Age Food Studios at Cooking Light. This is happy hour, it's Friday. It's been a long week, I know you've had one too. Today we're making margaritas for happy hour. This is a classic margarita, and I'm gonna show you how to make it. So first off, I wanna show you our peanut gallery uh, and our happy hour here. This is the Cooking Light Squad, if you wanna pan across. So for all of you people who are sitting in your desk chair still at work, watch this then go home. If you're in your car, get back to driving. Don't be watching this. Um, so, all right, so here's how you make it. We've got silver tequila. The difference between silver tequila and reposado. Reposado is, an, is aged. You want a silver. It hasn't been aged. It's super smooth. Um, optional, you've got Grand Marnier. Adds a little bit of sweet boost to it. Agave. This is what's going to make it sweet, and this is going to dissolve into the uh, lime juice and the tequila. And then the most crucial thing, fresh limes. If you're using bottled lime product, you're doing it wrong. So here's, here's how we do it. We're going to start out with a couple limes. Got a cocktail shaker here. Most important tool. This is my buddy right here. This is just a regular lime squeezer. So we're doing a couple limes in here. Good wrist uh, workout while you do it too. And you can get these lime squeezers uh, off of Amazon, they're really cheap. Keep this one out all summer long. All right, so about one and a half limes for cocktail. A little bit of ice. We are uh, lucky enough to have some of that uh, sonic ice here, little pellets. Okay, so you got ice. Next step, and this is key, you wanna put your agave in the jigger first. And the reason why we're doing agave first is because then we're gonna rinse the agave off with the tequila. And it's Friday, so a little bit more, okay. So, ice, lime juice, agave, tequila, pint glass. Seal it, and then we're gonna shake. And how you shake doesn't matter, just don't shake it all over yourself. Okay, so the metal's getting frosty, and uh, I've got the photographer over there telling me it's time to look at the cover, so we gotta go soon. Metal's getting frosty too frosty to hold, and when, you, when it's too frosty to hold, you're done, okay? This is for me, so I'm gonna make sure and taste and see if I have to adjust. All right, that's right on time. Glass if you're choosing. Now, you can strain this or not, but here's how we're gonna strain it. easy to chew. <laughs> if you like to chew your ice, it's easy to chew. I would actually use cracked ice for this. We just didn't have it. A little floater of Grand Marnier optional. All right, Cooking Light Facebook followers, this one's for you. Happy Friday, happy hour. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.